Hi, this is Ryan Brown from mockquestions.com. In today's video, we will be discussing five machine learning interview questions. But before we do that, just a quick disclaimer, these questions are not guaranteed to be asked at your interview. I've pulled all of today's questions and answers from our website, mockquestions.com. Now, let's get started. Question number one, in your opinion, what is the most valuable data applicable to our business? This is a general question which the interviewer will use to begin the conversation, learn more about your background, and collect information they can use throughout the interview. This question assumes that you've done some research on the company and industry and can provide specific information relevant to their business. When preparing for an interview, you should find out as much as you can about the organization, the position you are interviewing for, and the interviewer's background. This will help you anticipate the questions you will be asked and provide the information you need to respond to them. Since you are one of the leading organizations in the transportation industry, the most valuable data you can use to manage your business involves the public's use of transportation, their preferences, seasonal fluctuations, and the use of various modes of transportation. It would also be useful to know how transportation providers coordinate their activities to create an efficient network. Question number two, can you talk about deep learning and how it compares to other machine learning algorithms? This is a general question related to the field of machine learning. While it has some technical aspects, the interviewer uses it to better understand your communication style and your ability to discuss technical terms in simple, easy to understand language. The trick to these types of questions is not to overcomplicate them and spend too much time answering them. As with most interview questions, being brief and to the point will serve as your best strategy. The interviewer will ask you a follow-up question if they need additional information. Deep learning is a subset of machine learning. It is focused on neural networks and how to leverage principles from neuroscience to better model unlabeled and semi-structured data. The algorithms employed in deep learning classify data through the use of neural networks. Question number three, do you have a go-to algorithm and can you describe it to me? The purpose of this question is not to understand your favorite algorithm, but rather to see how you communicate and if you are able to explain complex topics in simple language. During most interviews, you'll be speaking with someone familiar with the job's technicalities for which you are interviewing. However, you may interview with someone from the personnel department or other business units within the company on some occasions. Being able to explain complex concepts in simple, easy to understand language demonstrates your ability to work cross-functionally in the organization. My favorite type of algorithms involve regression analysis. The process they use is to look at the way data performed in the past and use this to predict future trends. Along these, my favorite is decision force regression. This type of algorithm is both accurate and requires little training time for the users. Question number four, what experience do you have performing research in the field of machine learning? In addition to learning about your qualifications as a machine learning engineer, organizations are interested in how you may have contributed to the technology. Candidates who have done research, published papers, conducted studies, or otherwise enhanced machine learning knowledge will have an advantage over those who simply perform work in this field. In several of my previous positions, I worked with senior machine learning experts on research projects related to artificial intelligence. I was listed as an author of several publications about artificial intelligence, augmented reality, and other machine learning disciplines. Details of this are documented in my resume. Question number five. What steps would you use to create and implement a database decision-making system for our company's users? This is an operational question that the interviewer uses to better understand how you perform your job. The best way to respond to an operational question is to break down the processes you use into individual steps and briefly describe them in the order in which you execute them. Your answer to an operational question should be brief and to the point. You should also anticipate follow-up questions. When creating a database decision-making system, the first thing I do is interview the users to understand the problems they are trying to solve. I then research the sources of information that are relevant to the company's operations. Once I understand these, I create a system that incorporates databases, artificial intelligence tools, and machine learning principles. The final step is to develop a user interface which enables employees to quickly access the information they need. Thank you for watching. If you want more machine learning interview questions, then head over to mockquestions.com today and get started.